how to use sudo write sudo write tutorial hello and welcome to our channel webwiz in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to use sudo write so this is sudo write tutorial so please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial so the first thing that you need to do is open your browser and kindly go to sudo write.com or you can simply click the link on the description below and if you don't know this platform SudoWrite is a platform or software related to writing AI-generated content or language processing. AI language models like GPT-3 can be used to assist with writing tasks, creative writing, content generation, and many more. And to access this platform, they offer a variety of plans that you can choose. And by clicking on pricing, you will see here a list of plan that you can purchase. We have here hobby and student, professional, and max plans and below you will see the corresponding prices on each plan in which for hub and student amounting to ten dollars per month you will receive a thirty thousand ai words per month while for professional plan amounting to twenty five dollars per month you will get ninety thousand ai words per month while for max amounting to hundred dollars you will get three hundred thousand ai words per month and to start sudo write for free just proceed by clicking this button and on the signing box you can continue using your Google account, your Facebook, or even your email address. But I'm going to choose to continue with my Google account. So kind of click on it and just choose your account. And from here, it will ask you, where did you hear about SudoWrite? So I'm just going to enter ads and proceed by clicking the submit button below. And after that, you will be directed on the homepage of SudoWrite. In which from here, you can start creating or writing a story by generating your first draft. And as you can see on the right side panel, it will show you the history or other suggestion that you might like to add in your story. And this is what the dashboard looks like of SudoWrite. And as you can see on the right side panel, some of the information to guide you in writing or start discovering in SudoWrite. We have here SudoWrite 101 or live class, richer character descriptions with SudoWrite and many more. While on the left side, you will see the draft that you have made. And to create a new one, just proceed by clicking the plus button new, in which upon clicking on it, you will be directed in this page. And from here, you can start creating or generating your first drop. So let's try to create a brief scenario for our first drop. And after that, if you select all of this paragraph, it will show you other options including rewrite, describe, expand, insight, internal, and many more. And aside from that, you could also customize the context, including to make it bold, italic, underline, and many more. And as you can see on the top panel, you could also navigate the write, describe, rewrite, brainstorm, and more option. By selecting the write option, it will show you the auto, guided, tone shape, and write settings. But before you access some of those options, make sure that you already provide or write a content of your story to give the AI an idea to what the story all about. And of course, turn on your suggestion, in which you can see the suggestion on the right side panel. And to write using auto, it will enable you to generate content using artificial intelligence, and it will automatically generate the rest of the content based on the language pattern that you input. Well, by using the guided option, it will provide other suggestion or instruction, including setting of tone, specifying content's focus, or even requesting a certain plot points or themes to be included. While by using the tone ship, the user may request the AI to generate content that is formal, casual, humorous, or even professional. Web here, ominous, fantastical, fast-paced, and many more. While on the right settings, you will be able to adjust the amount of creativity, such as less or most, depending on your preference. And aside from that below, you could also customize the number of cards suggestion that you want to see on the right side panel. And you can even customize the length of cards or words depending on your preference. And you could also turn on the key details in which it will suggest an important details about your story you're writing. And aside from that, other options on the top panel is the describe option, in which using the describe option, it will enhance the sensory descriptions of your story, as it contains of different senses such as sight, hearing, taste, smell, and touch, which may help to vividly portray sensory experiences. 
And aside from that, using this option, you could also add other metaphor to make your story more creative to read. And now to the other option, which is called Rewrite. It will allow user to request the AI to replace or reword existing text. Well, by using the brainstorming option, it will enable users to generate ideas, themes, or content prompts for the writing projects. And by clicking the more option, it will show you that you can shrink ray, twist, add characters, or even poem to your story. For shrink ray, you can summarize the content of your story to make it look professional by deducting based on words or to summarize your content document the four different outputs such as logline, blurb, synopsis, and even outline. And by selecting the twist option under the more, the user may enter the genre of the story they're writing and the summary below of their story. And using this option, it may introduce unexpected or surprising elements to the writing of the story, in which it offers a way to add plot twists alternate storylines or unexpected developments to the content being generated. And aside from that, by navigating the characters option under the more, it will allow user to create and interact with the virtual characters within the context of their writing. And to do that, all you need to do is to fill out all of this required information, such as to describe your story premise, entering the name, description of the existing characters in the story. Now going back in this page to start editing or customizing the story that we're writing, all we need to do is to highlight the text and you can select any of the options that we just discussed. Such as by clicking the right option, you will see on the right side panel the suggestion that contain 200 words which can be helpful to continue the storyline of the story drop that we just input. To do that, you have the option to insert or copy the context. And by inserting the context, it will automatically add to your storyline but you can also choose other suggestion on the right side panel that you want to input in your storyline and now let's try the other option and to do that all you need to do is to highlight the whole context that will help an ai to have an idea about the context of your story that you want to change for example this word near future world by clicking the describe option on the top panel you will see the description on the right side panel of the word that we just highlight, in which we can choose either describe this as sight, smell, touch, and even metaphor. And you can also insert or copy the context. Moving on, in rewriting the whole context, all you need to do is to select at least 10 words from the content of your story in order to access the rewrite option on the top panel. And by clicking the rewrite button on the top panel, you will see the suggestion of paraphrase content on the right side of it and you can either insert or copy the full context aside from that by clicking the brainstorm option on the top panel it will give you an idea in terms of dialogue characters world building plot points names places and many more and you could also navigate the option under the more and use it to make your story more creative or professional and after that before importing the context that you just customized you could also customize the title of this draft. To do that, just click Untitled and just enter the title that you prefer. And after that, you can now start importing the context or story that you write using this platform. So that is just how to use SudoWrite, SudoWrite tutorial. Thank you.